afternoon and welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Mark and I'm going to take you for a walk around a 2015 Mitsubishi Outlander plug-in hybrid wagon this afternoon. At the front of the car yeah, you can see that uh, we've got headlight washers uh, just in conjunction with our HID headlights and we do have driving lights down in the bottom of our front bumper bar as well. I can't really pick any touch-ups or any, any marks or scratches on this car as such and uh, as we move around to the driver's side you'll see that uh, it's fairly similar all around. Factory alloy wheels, we've fitted brand new tyres to this car as well on the front of the car. Um, we've got our plug-in hybrid uh, badging just on the side of our guard there. Colour-coded exterior mirrors with our indicator incorporated in the mirror. And then chrome-outed door handles. We've got our little buttons on our doors because they are proximity keys and we've got both factory keys as well. Um, just a simple touch of that button to lock or unlock the car. No scratches on our alloy wheels either, which is really impressive. And then as we move around to the rear of the car, um, even in the tailgate area, not really any scratches that I can see anywhere on the bumper bar. Chrome badging, we've got our reverse camera integrated with our reverse parking sensors as well. And uh, as you can see, a fairly dark tint on that rear window as well. As we move around to the passenger side, the consistency is outstanding. Um, no scratches on the alloy wheels once again. Um, as we move to the front, let's just have a quick look at the front one there. No, that looks like just glue on that alloy wheel, so certainly impressive with the exterior condition. The only other thing we'll highlight is the fact that it does also have a factory sunroof as well, being the top of the range version, so I'm quite impressed with the exterior. The other thing we'll have a chat about now is just the performance of the car. Obviously, you know, you can run them on battery. Uh, there is the option of running it on petrol as well, but just based on the technology and, and the fuel economy, um, you know, you can expect to actually get over 2,000 kilometres out of, out of a tank of fuel and battery life, um, just being that sort of technology. Look around at the rear of the car now. Um, being the top of the range in the Outlander in this particular version, it does have an electric tailgate, so simple matter of pushing on one of our two, two buttons to uh, elevate the tailgate. All of our factory carpets there as well, which have just been cleaned. Got the cargo blind here as well, just to secure any, any, any cargo we've got in the back out of sight. And then we can just release it when it's not in use. Underneath our cover here, we've got a 15 and 10 amp uh, chargers, uh, just depending on what your power setup at home is. And then of course they don't run a spare wheel, so you've got a compressor kit there and also the liquid just in the event of having a flat tyre. There is a button on the tailgate as well. Uh, if we want to close that, either the push of the buttons on the keys or the push of the button on the tailgate itself. So here we are inside the Outlander now and uh, we'll just run through everything for you. All of our power window and power mirror switches here. Uh, we've also got buttons to turn off our parking sensors. Uh, also a, a button to open that tailgate that we just spoke about. And then of course uh, traction control there. And just a button to do something. There you go. Just uh, feed you information. Uh, height and reach adjustable steering wheel. Also does have auto headlights and auto wipers as well. Push button start, leather wrapped steering wheel, cruise control settings on our right hand side, audio and Bluetooth on our left hand side. They do incorporate uh, satellite navigation. Also, as we mentioned, reverse camera there as well. And um, all your main audio settings. It does have Bluetooth with audio streaming. Dual zone climate control air conditioning. As you can see, we've got that going at the moment. Then down the bottom here, we've got uh, a 12 volt outlet, a little cup holder, I call it, rather than an ashtray. Um, our T-bar automatic here, uh, which is just operated a little bit differently to, than uh, your generic passenger cars. A charge button and a save power button there as well. And I'll just open that up out of our way to, to show you the four wheel drive button there. Heated front seats in this car. And then of course auxiliary and uh, another 12 volt outlander there. 
another 12 volt outlet, not outlander, and a little coin tray as well. Leather wrapped console lid and fully, fully leather interior in this car as well. Leather infills in our door trims also. Um, and the other good thing as we scan around the interior, it does also have seven airbags this car. So front side curtain airbags and then knee airbag for the driver. So obviously comes to you with a five star ANCAP safety rating as well. Was originally a Mitsubishi car and first registered uh, the 7th of December 2015. So you've still got new car warranty as well. And then of course serviced by Mitsubishi Australia originally. And uh, we've just done an intermediate service on the car because this particular one has only done 28,000 kilometres. So uh, certainly uh, presents uh, consistently with what case it's done. Hope this has given you a really good idea of our 2015 Mitsubishi Outlander plug-in hybrid uh, wagon today. Top of the range, under 30,000 Ks, still under new car warranty, five star ANCAP safety rating, and there's not really many other extras you can put in a car. So give us a call on 99070 and also ask one of our staff members about our premium mechanical protection plan, which can take over at the end of new car warranty and give you a further five years premium mechanical protection, including 10 years platinum roadside assistance. Don't forget the number once again, 9907 055.